guys, today I'm going to talk about one of my favorite new speculations. I It is a standard speculation, and standard is okay to spec on right now and buy some cards, maybe a playset, maybe an extra playset of it in case it goes up, because rotation is back to its regular length. Uh, when rotation was a lot shorter, it didn't really make sense to pick these cards up because there wasn't the time to, for it to grow or find a home. I like this card a lot. I said not to buy it when it was at $27 because it's not worth $27. But the question now is, is it worth $7? You can get as many copies of this as you want on eBay. $7 shipped to you. I think it's around 20 22 a playset finished. eBay finished, so around $6 for a play, uh, a per Nissa if you buy a playset. Overall, a very, very strong card, a very unique card. A card with uh, multiple things that I like. Mainly I like the fact that it's in standard for some time. So it can find a home. And it can also, it's a fantastic EDH card. And it's a lot of fun to play with. And it belongs in the majority of EDH decks. I like it a lot in Magic Duels. I think it is one of the, uh, it is one of the strongest cards there. Overall, great card and definitely one to look for in, in trades. Seven dollars is very reasonable right now. She could go down all the way to five, but we will see. Um, at five for a in standard planeswalker, that's you know a no brainer unless it's a tailbolt of some type, which this card is not. Uh, it does have a home in EDH, so definitely a you know seven is very close to five. At five, this card is a no brainer in terms of picking up a playset of it. Anyway, bye guys.